Hi, this is a quick NVIDIA Jetson TX2 unboxing video just to let you know what you get in the package. So obviously I've already been in here and opened this up and you can see that you get the uh, board uh, inside an anti-static bag which looks like this it has a M.2 key E header there, a PCIe X4 header, a load of GPIOs, the Wi-Fi, USB 3, HDMI, full size SD card I think, power connector, gig, Ethernet, fly not included, and what else is in the box? Okay. We've got the brief getting started instruction manual here, which has got the kit contents listed, some of the information on the board, few tips on storing the header, initial login values, and a bit of notes about recovery mode, explanation about all the headers that I just went through, and that's about it. And then there is a safety guide, which basically mentions all things you shouldn't do with it take anti-static precautions, blah 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 and uh, helpfully mentions the power rating down here which is 5.5 volts at 14.5 amps to 19.6 volts at 4.74 amps and the rest of it is in different languages and then also inside the box on the underneath layer, a little bit like a box of chocolates, we have a Euro kettle adapter, a UK plug kettle adapter, a quite a large brick power supply, which seems to be made by Meanwell made in Taiwan must have the power rating on it somewhere here we go 100 to 240 volts at 1.3 amps puts out 19 volts at 7.7 sorry 4.74 volts 90 watts max what else is in the box Right, these are the remaining items. You have a micro USB. Looks like micro USB. Yeah, micro USB. Uh, a USB. Here we go. Uh, micro USB to USB A. USB micro B to female USB A, and the two Wi-Fi antennae which just as a little bonus for you guys I will put on right now not that I plan to use the Wi-Fi because I'm going to use Ethernet I think looking antennae pedal paddles and there we have it that's an Nvidia Jetson TX2 unboxed more soon